This is the solution to written homework 47. Okay, so the first step in the sign chart method. Oops, <laughs> the first step in the sign chart method is to find the natural domain. Okay, so then that's anything except negative 4. Plug in negative 4, that inequality is undefined. Okay, the second step is the zero and simplify step. So, 3x minus 1 over x plus 4, and then minus 2 is less or equal to 0. So now we've zeroed one side. That's the 0 and the 0 and simplify. So now to simplify, we want to express the left-hand side as a single fraction. So how about 3x minus 1? x plus 4 and minus 2 x plus 4 over x plus 4 uh, is less or equal to 0. So this x plus 4 over that x plus 4, that's 1. So that's getting a common denominator here. So then this would be 3x minus 1 over x plus 4 and then minus 2x plus 8 over x plus 4 plus or equal to 0. So now we'll perform the subtraction. So 3x minus 1 minus 2x plus 8 all over x plus 4 is less or equal to 0. And then 3x minus 2x is just a single x. And then negative 1 minus 8 is negative 9, so x minus 9 over x plus 4 is less or equal zero. So this is the simplified step. <clears throat> okay. So the next step is we want to solve the corresponding equation. So we're going to solve x minus 9 divided by x plus 4 equal zero. Well, that's the same thing as saying that x minus nine is equal to zero, so x is nine. Okay. The next step, the sign chart method is named after this step. So this is where we actually make the sign chart. negative 4 and 9. Negative 4 comes from the break in the natural domain. 9 comes from a solution to the original problem, or to the, to the equation. Uh, so now, a point over here is negative 5. A point in here is, how about, 8. A point in here is 10. So now we're going to take those values and we're going to evaluate this expression. OK. 
Okay, so if we plug in negative 5, the numerator will be negative. And if we plug in negative 5, the denominator will be negative. If we plug in 8, the numerator is negative, and the denominator positive. And if we plug in 10, positive over positive. So the overall sign in each region is positive, and then negative, and then positive. So now we are in a position to make a conclusion and the conclusion is that we want the negative regions so the reason why we want the negative regions is because of this So it says we want this zeroed and simplified uh, expression to be less than or equal to zero. So we want the negative regions. So the region from negative 4 to positive 9 is the answer that we're looking for. And it's going to have to be not including negative 4, because it's not in the natural domain, up to 9 and including 9. Including 9 because it satisfies uh, that equation, that inequality. And that's the answer.